is a celebration of all things art. More than 130 artists, both local and national, are taking over Exarban Village for the 49th annual Summer Arts Festival. KETV News Watch 7's Kaylee Searcy spoke to creators coming back for another year of creativity. A weekend festival that begins bright and early for many. Bringing hundreds of artists to the heart of Exarban to show off their work. I've been an artist all my life. We do a, a lot of holiday carving uh, out of cottonwood bark. It's all done on copper, natural chemical reactions and different heats pull out those colors naturally with a little grinder to pull out the burst effects. There's no paints or dyes used at all. It's pure science behind the copper. 49 years of strengthening the arts within the Omaha Metro, using the talents of the community to grow the Summer Arts Festival. So I've been doing this show about 10 years now. Um, started off when we were downtown, worked our way up to Exarban Village here. Adam Weiss is a self-taught artist finding his calling at the age of 18. Now he's selling his art at festivals like this one. 99% of sales come at art shows. People like to see the actual physical piece. They want to touch it a lot of time. Longtime artist Barbara Egger uses her paintbrush to connect with the world around her. Art is healing. It's always been my therapy, so I feel like it's important emotionally. And at the Summer Arts Festival, painter Mel Smith says it's the easiest way to foster interest starting young. Little kids, because they'll come up to you and they'll be like, do you paint these? And they're just excited to see what you're doing and I let them pick out colors or whatever. And it's super fun because they're just interested. And continue celebrating the peace that brings Omaha together. The music, the the food, the activities, the, the artists, you know, support local art for sure. We all need support. Kaylee Searcy, KETV, Newswatch 7.